There are some members in the Senate. I, I tried yesterday, as you can see, if you watch, not to get to that level, but I didn't succeed. And uh, when they put it into voice vote, you still had people that said nay. So it's normal in democracy, like ours, where the majority will have its way. And uh, the minority have, have its say. Uh, as I said yesterday, I tried to douse the tension and try to beg Kuningi uh, um, uh, uh, to apologize and um, also to uh, beg the presiding officer to, you know, be, be temper it. Um, but what worried me yesterday, let me be honest with you, I sit next to the leader. My leader was very, the leader of the Senate was very angry of what uh, Tinubu did, and I mean, mm -hmm. Ningi did. did. But honestly, to me too, it was wrong. What he did was wrong. Because I was involved. In the first instance, it started. There was, remember, I, I hear, I discussed with you, when they said the uh, capital project in the budget was skewed to the south, and that out of the 15 trillion, eh, uh, south and north got 2.5. And that uh, this, so I came here and I told you that the total in that time that was brought before us by the president is not up to nine trillion; it was eight point nine. And they are talking about skewed uh, uh, capital project to, to the to the south, uh, and the total adding up to fifteen um, fifteen trillion. <laughs> that fifteen trillion is strange. Even with the amendment that we made, the capital component of this budget is not up to ten so trillion. So, what you're saying is that Senator Ningi, in your own, uh, in the sensibility of some of the senators that are angry, was trying to ethnicize the, the and politicize yes, that is it. the budget. That is it. Which was wrong, totally. Ningi shouldn't have done that.